Okay, folks. Got a new knife in today. And this is how it comes in the white box. Nothing special. And there you see the Riate. This is what you get. Um, get this cool little case here. And we'll open it up and see what's inside. Okay, you get these extra little washers and screws which is nice if you ever want to change them out or strip one when you're trying to work on the knife now <clears throat> I did open this but this is how this knife comes brand new it's unboxing um, and I'll show you I opened it because this has been cut where I cut it it comes sealed so that's straight from the package house in China Put that aside. Uh, this case is kind of padded. <clears throat> neat little thing. It's got a holder there if you want to hold the knife in there. So it's kind of neat. The Riate Horizon. No, this is not the Horizon. Sorry about that. This is the what do they call this? There's no paperwork with this knife. I mean, zero. But this is the <clears throat> District 9. And when you're looking at this knife online, you can't see, but right there you'll get a glimpse. See that goldish, like right in here? That's kind of on this knife, just in certain spots. And down here by the clip, you can see the camera focus. Maybe it's not going to want to focus on that. There we go. See that goldish kind of color? <clears throat> so it's not just a... Um, you get a little bit of that tan in there. And you can see some down in the grooves. Um, neat little thing is these blue backspacers there. Some tiny jimp in there. Nothing hot spots. You got this lock up over travel now this knife is new brand new cool pocket clip I didn't I seen these knives online for like gee a long time and I said well <clears throat> Riate's done me so good on their other ones I said I don't think I'll go wrong in getting one of these <clears throat> excuse me and so be it the backspacer is pretty much the same color as the clip, the almost like a goldish bronze. So and you see there it says district nine. And flipping fires right out. There you see the S35 B in blade. That's what those little numbers are. If the camera will focus quickly, quickly, or I'm going to move on. There we go. 
Um, and then you got the Riate logo. Sharpness, give it a. I'd give it a eight or seven point five out of ten. It's sharp. Um, you see the stone wash blade. Feel in the hand, great. Lock up. Here's what I do like about this knife. It's got the steel insert here, so that it will not wear on you titanium and last longer. These knives are one ninety nine. I think they are. I'm not for sure. I'd have to look up on. I got this at Blade HQ. Great place to buy knives. They're always Blade HQs always just boom on the shipping. Um, great looking knife. Um, is it the prettiest knife in the world? No. But let's talk functionality. This thing fires open. The lockup is good, as you can see. Probably what? 30%. Uh, to close it is just really easy. That means a lot to me. Blade centering. There you go. Very good on the blade as far as centering. Um, not a bad looking knife. So this is the Horizon, or not the Horizon. I like my Horizon better. <clears throat> they cost a little more, but me, honestly, I like the Horizon better. Actually, this knife almost feels a little more bulky and not as smooth. But this knife feels good in the hand. Um, just a great looking knife. So, the flippers just great. Easy one hand close. Easy one hand close. And let's look at that detent look. Really good on the detent. So the District 9 folder, they got another version of this with a different style of blade. I think it's a, no, it's not a different style blade. It's actually got a different look here. It's more of the one single meal in there on the titanium. If I remember correct, I haven't looked at them in a day or two, but, uh, Everybody's giving good reviews on this knife. The pocket clip is not a hot spot in your hand, which is good. Uh, to thumb open it, it really, it's kind of stiff. I mean, you could do it, but it takes some pressure. So, it's more of a flipper. And the flipper works great. This is just more for lockup, really. Great knife. Um, for the money. Let me get that blade center, and I want you to see that. Now, that is very centered, very well. And, uh,. It's definitely a great nap. The blade, kind of a unique kind of blade with a drop here, but am 
am I super impressed with this knife? As far as function and feel, it's great. I mean, you couldn't really ask for no better. I mean, very solid knife. So, gee, I've been on here 10 minutes going on about this knife. You got your little like the blue in the back. Great knife. If you're wanting to get a good knife that is worth the money that you're not going to be disappointed with, I have to say, guys, you need to really think about buying these Chinese knives. They are just very well built. And super smooth. Just that flipper is better than most other flippers I've got. And I've got a lot. Great. So one more look, see. Just a great looking knife. Seems like the more you handle this knife, the more you will like it. The good thing is, good rounded corners everywhere. Um, so, and this knife is heavy duty. Just trust me, this knife you can do some heavy duty cutting with. Because that's a big stout blade and it's put together stout. Now, this is the kind of knife you could put on a piece of wood and start hammering here, and it's going to chop that wood, split your wood for you. If you ain't got an axe and you was at camp. So, there you go. The Riate District 9 Flipper Folder. Great knife. Uh, when I do find out some bad about it, I will let you know, but I don't really think I'm going to. Got a little lanyard hole there. The pocket clip is great. Looks great. Not very high riding. And in the back or in the middle or in the front of the clip. And good smooth rounded edges here. Tell you what. You'll be happy you get one of these. Feel like you got your money's worth and these are reasonable priced so uh, if you're wondering you want to for sure bet get you one of these thanks and uh, if you have any questions leave a comment but I don't think you will great knife so pick you one up while you can and they should be plenty of these because I think there's a big a uh, lot of these still left at every knife website I've looked at. So you can pick these up. And these will probably even go on sale by the end of the year. And you'll be able to get these cheaper, if not before. And if you're talking like 169 for one of these knives, 150 anybody would be stupid not to buy one. Because it's going to last you a lifetime. And as I said, plus you get these, uh, this comes with it. So, you know, you can always work on it yourself because they're rather simply put together. Don't take no rocket scientists to work on these. So there you go. Have a good one. We'll see you on the next review.